guess the playground is off the limits. Yes, really. If you tap now, I believe you. I believe you, Spotify. I can't press shit. And they're so fucking loud, I swear. So you gotta turn this shit down or it sounds like a blown speaker. Because the ads are 20 times louder than the music being played. So if you have a louder bike, it might be a little harder. Actually, I got the volume down right now. Never mind. Just scratch that. Those fucking ads. Okay. Let's just come to a complete fucking stop. Kawasaki? Kawasaki? Yeah. Was that just a smaller version of the bike? Yeah, it's a 125. Damn. It's a Z125. Right. Yeah, 65. Oh, yeah. See ya. <laughs> Alright, well that threw me. Wasn't expecting that one. Actually, at the uh, kind of higher volumes, depending on the song, the bass kind of sounds clippy. So that's full blast. It's not too bad, I guess, but... I swear, these lights never change. I could sit here fucking all day. Oh. I lied. So yeah, um, <laughs> the Domeo changes the riding experience. I'm getting to listen to music. Um, just, it's nice. And I don't like earbuds, so it's really nice not to have to fuck with those. This for volume right now is probably about 70%. Um, you're just cruising around town doing 40. It's perfect. And of course you can still hear everything else around you, right? So. I swear that's part of the reason these bikes are so fun. You just like rip it right off and uh, Almost not get a ticket, as long as you're not in the school zone, I guess. Ooh. Jay Farner here, CEO of Roger Orange. Oh, thank you, Spotify. That's what they're at. This is like the cancer zone or something. And if you use extra money, a cash out refinance could give you that money. Ooh. I actually do. But you listen to Spotify. Thanks for that.
it's funny, I'm actually newer to uh, motorcycle riding, so I've done it for uh, two years now. I've got 6,000 miles on this thing so far. And um, I guess the most irritating thing or aspect out of everything is having to deal with the bugs. Man, I didn't think it would be that bad. And I'm surprised the uh, motorcycle helmet doesn't have some sort of filter for the mouthpiece. And I've learned that it seems that most uh, helmets don't include any sort of filtration. So bugs just fly in. It's a pain in the ass. What up, future moto bro? There we go. Let's let's fucking do four miles an hour. Seriously, your preciousness. It's funny when I'm riding in residential. Sometimes it sounds like it's. Uh, almost too loud, which I guess isn't a bad thing, but with the kind of point of uh, writing and listening to music while you're writing to escape everything. So I'll have to do a video on my uh, GoPro setup with the external power pack that I have in my backpack, which will allow it to record for, it should be, close to seven or eight hours. Um, I haven't tested it yet. I plan on testing it though. And I'll make a video. And uh, the only limitation I have with that is my 128 gigabyte SD card. Um, clearly that's going to fill up in two hours. So um, either I need to get something like a 512 or I could just, I guess, could live stream or stream in general, and then, uh, yeah, I'll probably just get a 512, right? So, and then uh, see how long I can record continuously with the GoPro 8 and Media Mod and the Purple Panda mic, right? Such serious conversations being had. In the hood. And with my uh, Viami Mice music. Perfect for nighttime writing, like just being able to listen to music at night and catch the cool breeze, even though uh, you're on a little tiny bike, right? It's perfect. Fuck what the haters say, man. Pothole heaven. It'll be interesting to hear how well this mic records my voice since I'm trying to not talk too loud. Not that I should, because it should pick up my voice rather well. I just don't want it to sound muffled. Like those moments when you're recording, you get your GoPro mounted and people drive by and then they do that sudden realization that they're being recorded look and like oh shit. It's kind of funny. Then there's the people that like want to stop up and say something to you. What's up future motor bro? When you have your man he was really shocked wasn't he? <laughs> um People see that you're recording with a GoPro and they want to they wanna be in the video. So they definitely just come up and stop and say something to you every time. Kid was cheesing. He liked it. In reality, I probably look like a damn goofball on this bike with a backpack and a wire hanging out just to keep the uh, 
battery going on this GoPro, which the problem with these GoPro, the eights, the fucking battery only lasts for like 40 minutes, man. Especially if you got the GPS enabled and any mic. Um, voice activation features enabled. This just like sucks the battery dry. But that shouldn't be a problem now that I have this external cassette tape power pack, which I'll show in my next video. It's 39 bucks. It's like you can afford a GoPro, you wear a backpack, you can afford a $40 uh, battery pack to power it for eight hours. This is ridiculous, right? Especially if you're into moto vlogging, like it could just makes sense. Run across this bridge. Quick, quick, quick. Alright, so I don't like this song very much, but I'm going to change it with a small tap on the back of my Domeo. And I just changed the song. Hold it in for two seconds, change the song, and I'm not sure I like this one either. More garbage. Hmm. Spotify, I thought you knew me so well. Okay. Let's see. Oh shit. Got the big boys nodding. Never happens. Took him a second. He noticed that. He looked at me like, eh, this is a real fucking ah, fuck, he's on GoPro. He's probably recording this shit. Nod. Fucking respect. Right? Kinda funny. I would show my bike in this video, but it's so fucking dirty. It's been sitting for almost two months. And then when I did ride it the other day, it rained, so there's just shit mud slinged all over it. Don't worry guys, I'm not behind you. You can run me over. Fuck it. Alright, so this is probably gonna I guess conclude the um, Domo Domeo Moto Sports uh, audio helmet thingy majig with a purple panda mic inside the helmet and uh, attached to the media mod on the GoPro 8 just to give you an idea. Okay. All right. See ya. Twenty points for the duck. Oh shit. <laughs> Shit. I hate those fucking things. <laughs> and yes, I know they're fucking geese. Everybody just wants to say duck first. Like my phone. One of other cricks. My favorite word to duck. Such a nice night. Day. Afternoon. Evening. Skirt. No skirt. These tires are super grippy, man. Like, um... Okay, what the fuck are you guys doing? Did someone get in an accident early? Jesus Christ. Sucks. How do you do that shit? Oh, you could hear me from a distance. How about that? And I have a stock exhaust, so I don't need a fucking um, Harley exhaust for you to hear me from down the street. Incredible. Believe what you want, guys. Some synth wave. Give it a few more hours. Nice and dark out. Add some neon. Boom. Come on, guys. Okay, I'm going. See you later. How about that? So you think you're going so fast on these little bikes? I'm like, oh, am I doing 50? No, I was doing 39, 40. No problem. No problem. Keeping up just fine. 
to get, I guess, some new tires. Um, they're the Michelin City Grips, and they are fucking amazing. It's the best mod you can do to your bike, I swear, if you haven't done it. Get some new tires. The stock tires are dog shit. And you, you'll soon realize, as soon as you put on the new tires, you're like, wow, the stock tires are dog shit. Take my word for it. You know how you get the uh, little thin lines in the road here and it kind of like jerks you to the left and jerks you to the right. It's kind of scary as fuck. Not, not a problem with these uh, city grips, man. It, of course, I did get uh, 120 in the front, 130 in the back, so they're, they're pretty, pretty wide for this bike. But oh my god, it feels like I don't know. It just feels amazing compared to stock. So it really plants your ass down, and you no longer have to worry about the squirreliness involved of the uh, just about anything in the road. So definitely a confidence booster while riding these little bikes especially when you're doing 55 or 60 and things get a little hairy when the wind starts blowing your ass all over the place all right and bust around here again another thing about these bikes that are so great you can turn on a dime couldn't do that shit on a harley you can't get no big boy, no big boy, you can't do that. That's okay though. Different purpose, different bike. I'm not mad at you, Harley. But... So it will be interesting too. I have the um, the mic muffler, the uh, mic muffle, the mic, whatever that mic thing that goes on the mic to keep the wind from being a problem on the Purple Panda. I forget the name of it now. And... I'll probably forget the name of it until I either remember it later tomorrow or look it up. But, uh. Yeah, the furry little jacket that you put on your purple panda. To make the audio happy, right? This is my first real moto vlog, and, uh. I wouldn't even really call it a first moto vlog as much as it is just a Domeo Moto Sports audio helmet, not review, I'm not reviewing, but a uh, preview before you buy it, because you can hear just how loud it actually is in the helmet with the purple family. The tires, uh, the bigger tires, definitely make the, uh, they say turning harder, but I wouldn't say harder, but it's heavier. Um, it just feels heavier. But you have more tire space to uh, kind of grip onto, right? So that makes sense. That would make sense. But with that comes stability. And stability is a nice thing to have on these little bikes. No more squirreliness, no. A little harder to school the tires at a stop too, but you know, whatever. And for like 112 bucks, man, you can't go wrong. All right, what do I want to do, guys? Where should I go? Damn it! Are they really having a lemonade stand? Oh my god, I gotta buy a lemonade, guys. This is perfect. Okay, I'm just kidding. I'm buying a fucking lemonade, but probably garbage anyways. Well water shit. It's okay, bro. You can go fishing sometime. Sometimes you get carried away on these bikes, man. You don't know how fast you're going. It's like, you're just having a blast. and You know, again, like, oh, I'm doing 40 in a residential. That's totally fine. What is the fucking in my shit? Son of a bitch. Let's pull over here and park in front of this house like I own it. JK. LOL. OMG. F U C K Y O U. Fucking bullshit.
seriously, what the fuck is going on? So what I was talking about earlier, bugs, man. They're so fucking gross. Yeah, I'm such a little prima donna bitch, I know, but who the fuck likes eating bugs, am I right? The mic fell out. What the fuck, dude? One day soon, my Willy game will be one. Or something. Oh shit, here comes the wall. Oh shit. People can talk shit about my bike all day long. But you have people riding around in fucking go karts. Golf carts. Golf carts. That's what that is. Not a Golf carts. any drugs today. Maybe some other day. No. Unlikely. Don't do drugs, kids. It'll make you fucking retarded. <laughs> Alright. That was quite the run. Turn you off. Lock you up. Shut you down. Good night.